Mommy loved to read Captain Underpants to us. Um, at night, story reading time, we were like, one more chapter, please. She's like, fine. And then when she read that chapter, um, we had to go to bed, even though we wanted to read the whole book. So that's why I chose this book to give to Mommy. And I hope she gets in, in heaven. When they went to Camp Good Grief, I think that's the, like the moment that the healing started. And that was when I said, okay, I think maybe it's going to be all right. The children that we see here will say, good grief. Well, it's so good about grief. Because when they first start coming here, there's nothing good about grief. I was lost. I gave myself like a year max. And then we went to Camp Good Grief and I was like, no, I peanut inspired really. I came here and my buddy, he was happy. And I was like, how could somebody be so happy? And to find out that we all lost somebody, I was like, wait, wait, wait. We're all here to just give back to the um, place that helped us so much. I mean, this really helped me through the past like six years that I've been here. So I don't think I would be who I am today without the Grief Center. To be able to work with them and see their progress and to see the good that can come from that grief. Nobody wants to come here. I wish we didn't have a Center for Good Grief. I wish we didn't need it. I want to say I was 14. It was the, wow, I'm sorry really going into a person's love story and, and how to cope and really seeing the connection that grief is just an expression of love. I get to see people get better and I can tell other grieving people that because you know sometimes they'll come to us and they don't believe that things can get better for them and so I let them know that I wouldn't do this job if people didn't get better but they do.